Hi, my name is Pastor Greg from FBC Medford, and welcome to today's eConnect. Today is November 4th, 2022. Hi, I'm Pastor Jeff, and I want to take a moment to say thank you so much, FBC Church family, for the volunteers that came out to help with Harvest Festival. This could not be possible without you. And I want to thank you so much for the candy drive as well. We had plenty of candy. We had uh, plenty of volunteers and all the resources that came together to make this night a wonderful night for families to come to our gym and also to enjoy the trunk or treat. We had a great night. We had about 400 plus that came out to enjoy the evening together. I want to say thank you for taking the time to volunteer because it's more than just volunteering. It's taking the opportunity to use your gifts and your abilities that God has given you to advance the kingdom and to share the gospel with others. Here's what the Bible says in Luke chapter 17, verses 3 and 4. Pay attention to yourselves. If your brother sins, rebuke him. And if he repents, forgive him. And if he sins against you seven times in the day and turns to you seven times saying, I repent, you must forgive him. This is a profound teaching from Jesus telling us about how our relationships in the body of Christ are to operate. They're to operate with forgiveness that's overwhelming. To think that somebody could do something wrong seven times in a day and we would extend forgiveness to them seems unbelievable. But that's exactly what Jesus is calling us to do. He's calling us to recognize how much forgiveness we have received from Jesus. I mean, think about your own life. Have you needed Jesus' forgiveness seven times today? All Jesus is asking us to do is to conduct our relationships with one another in the same way he conducts his relationship with us, which is to offer ongoing forgiveness. Now, this doesn't mean that we have to allow people to walk all over us. Think of it more of like a coach. When a player is struggling to get something right, the coach will keep encouraging the player. Try again. You can do it this time. This is how we approach forgiveness in relationships in the church. Try it again. You'll get it this time. I forgive you. I look forward to being with you this Sunday, November 6th. The passage we're going to look at for our sermon this Sunday is Luke chapter 17, verses 1 through 10. Don't forget to set your clock back. We'll see you then.